hey guys welcome again to another video and guys today we want to do some cleaning in the kitchen as the title suggests it's long since i last did that but today i decided this is the time this will be my working table for today and so i'll just cover it with this cloth so that i don't scratch it with uh, the utensils that i get from the other side i'll begin by tidying up my sink area I'm going to do some kind of makeover somehow so that I can replace these curtains. I've suffered a lot with this uh, sink area because if I put up a curtain that goes all the way to cover the whole window, somehow it gets too close to the tap to an extent that I cannot even wash my utensils peacefully. So I want to replace this one with some short curtains and I think that will work so well with this space why did she go i met her back in 2005 it was a crooked little on the lower side of the window i'm going to put these panels that i got from panda mat because this time i've decided to install very short curtains so that they don't interfere with me while i'm washing anything here at the sink this window doesn't allow much light in because it's from the inside of uh, the building. Yeah, it's from the inner side. So there's not much light coming in from it. And that's why there will be no difference whether I uh, cover it a bit with these panels or if I decide to just leave that, there will be no difference. Why did she go? Whoa. Was I supposed? you can see how short the curtain is yeah this is how i want it and uh, there's another one that i'm going to push from the inside but it was a bit long than this one so i returned it back to the fundi so that they can repair it yeah by tomorrow it will be here so that i can put it from the inside and this one will be up my window is next to the lift and that's why I have to cover that part so that no one will get to see the house. After that, I'm just cleaning this whole space so that I can go ahead with the decoration. This is my pot of uh, pothos. I'm going to put some pebbles to fill some pebbles right here. I've just removed it from outside so that I can use it to decorate the window. I put my feet up and we just sing along and I can't help but feeling just loving this moment. Can we stay here forever? I'm loving this moment. Can we stay here together? If I could stop the time, don't you know that I would? Cause I'm just loving this moment. I want to clean the upper cabinet so I'll remove everything from the countertop so that I can use that as my working space. I'm going to wash all the glasses from the last cabinet, the ones that I'm removing above the microwave because that cabinet is always open and so it's very dusty 
very very dusty i don't even use the glasses anymore i'm loving this moment can we stay here and this is what i was talking about can we stay here forever i'm loving this moment can we stay here forever i'm loving this moment Just loving this moment Can we stay here forever? I'm loving this moment Can we stay here together? If I could stop the time Don't you know that I would Cause I'm just loving this moment Can we stay here forever? Forever Forever Do you know I'm looking? About to leave, already packing. Come with me, I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't. to see the world in action what we can be like with no distractions we'll get away this is what we waited i don't want that utensils to pile up here so i'm going to wash the glasses and then i let them dry as i continue with my arranging can't miss out i'm done living life with the lights out My microwave too is very dirty and so I think I've taken like uh, three to four months without cleaning it thoroughly. So I'm just going to use some lemon, I'll put that in water and then I warm it for about three to five minutes and uh, I'll wipe that then with that my microwave will be clean. As that heats up, I'm going to put some snacks that I'll be eating throughout the week because now I don't want to eat that much. 
so i nowadays trick my brain and stomach by eating some few snacks that don't fill my stomach that much and that's what i'm going to arrange right away some cornflakes popcorns and biscuits though i lost some of my biscuits in my shopping yeah so i'm just going to arrange the ones that i have right now and then the rest maybe i'll look for later while arranging my shopping tomorrow Now that I'm done cleaning the upper side, I'm also going to clean this countertop well now because I sprayed some insect killers yeah, to kill a few cockroaches that I saw around. That's why I even decided to clean this house because I saw two or three and the moment you see that number, you know that there are some that are hiding somewhere. So I sprayed the whole house, most of the kitchen side and so I just want to clean this part also so well, the countertops 
and then after that I'll dry that up and then return my utensils back. Now I'm going to install these uh, lights right here. I love how they look. These ones I got last week. I'm going to install them under my cabinet. And these ones are sensor lights. They always sense you when you come and then they open. Or can I say they switch on? And then when you go, they switch off. So I will not recommend them that much for the kitchen cabinets. I'll mainly recommend this for your bedroom cabinets or let me say your closet yeah there they can work so well and each is both in warm white and white color so they can light up in two different colors white and warm white you can't just see that through the camera but that's how it is So this is what you use to stick it up and then you can remove that and always charge and return whenever you want to return them. Let me arrange the countertop and then I'll later show you how the lights light up at night. And so let there be light this is how the lights turned out but still I'll recommend this for the closet than uh, the kitchen cabinet and that's how they go off I'll now move to my smaller drawers I'm going to remove everything clean the drawers up and then I'll return just a few of the items because some of them I'll give out some also I'm going to get rid of because I no longer use them and also they are old. Yeah, I've used them for quite a long time now. Yeah, so that's what I'm going to do so that this place can also remain tidy. The ones that I'm going to give out are not old, but still I've used them so much that I feel like I need to change that. And also I'm not going to give them to my followers because I don't like that. I'd rather give you new items. These ones I'm going to give to family members who are still young and just starting up life. Yeah, they're the ones that I'm going to give these ones to so that we can at least reduce the burden for them for buying this old stuff. You said it was the last time but you keep coming back to town me Sorry that you take back All the things you said just to hurt me I love just went cold But I'm still burning I love just went cold Why? I keep on making the same mistake
And this one now, I clean almost every day. That's the best way to keep cockroaches away from your house. Say your burn. 
I'm going to mop the kitchen and I'm happy that I have a new dining carpet which I'm going to put after this. I'm going to sweep the kitchen first and then after that I'm going to mop it. And guys as you can see I'm so happy that I got these wheels for my cooker. Just in case you don't have them I'll highly recommend them. To keep these insects away from your house you would need to clean even under your cooker and if you need them you can get them from glappy suppliers you can both use them on your washing machines and also on your cookers even if you have the biggest cooker it's easy for you to clean under the cooker you've seen how it's made that effortless to move the cooker around and this is one of the items that I'll highly highly recommend in any kitchen to just keep your kitchen clean everywhere you need you really really need it because that's where you cook and all the food drop and that's how you get to feed and multiply the cockroaches in the house
I'm done guys thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next one